Hi everyone! Today I'm going to be showing you how to create and design your own infographic using the web application Canva. So here I am logged into Canva already and to make a new infographic all I have to do is click up here to the create a design button in the top right hand corner and then you'll see this menu pop up. I'm going to select infographic And automatically, you will see pop up all these different templates that you can choose from. And then you can choose a template based on what type of information you want to put out there with your infographic. So for myself, I'm going to create a series of steps to internet safety. So I'm going to choose this template that's called Simple Steps to Bicycle Safety. So all I need to do now is go through each of these pre-made text boxes and pre-made little images here, and I'm just going to change them to be the content that I want it to be. So in order to zoom, you just go down to the this little bottom zoom button in the bottom right hand corner, and you can choose, right now it's fit, so you can see the whole thing, but I want to click fill so I can see it up close. So then to change the text, all you have to do is click on the text that you want to change and then just type in what you want to put. To change the pictures here is very simple. I'm just going to select it and then just hit the backspace key on my computer to remove it. And you'll notice here on this far left hand side menu, I can upload my own content if I want, or I can choose some pre-uploaded pictures or upload my own or I can choose elements so these are icon style images that I can include I'm going to choose these and then you can search for your own so since it's internet safety I'll choose the image of a lock if it has a crown next to it that means it's part of a paid account but there's plenty of free that you can also use. So just to give you an example, I'm just going to click on it and drag it over. And then I'm just going to hover my mouse over one of the corners of this new image and resize it just by dragging my mouse out. And then you'll notice these little purple lines show up that help me align the picture to the text on the right hand side here. Also, a really great thing you can do when you are clicked on an image, you can change the color of it by coming up to this top left hand corner and selecting color. I'm so I'm going to click on that. So you can choose a new color, you can choose a default color, or you can select one of the documents existing colors. So if I wanted to make it pink, I could do that. So I'm going to do that for the whole rest of this infographic. And design my own. And there's plenty other controls that you can play with. You can change the transparency, you can change the background color, you can do all kinds of things with it. You can make it your own really. But it is really helpful to have these pre-made templates because it takes out a lot of that work for you. So now I'm going to show you on a different tab, this is back at the home page, all your designs. This is what my final product looks like. So you'll notice, let me choose a different sizing so you could get a closer look at it. I've changed the text, I've changed the elements to make it closer to what I want to communicate, and that's it. So then the last thing I want to do with this is to download it. So I can click the download image up here in this top right hand corner, or I can go to this little drop down arrow in the far right hand upper hand side and click download it and then I can just download it. It's going to download as a PDF and that's it. So thanks for watching!